Hello, this is Victor. I'm here with a new studio update. It's incredible what we are at December. So the end month, the uh, finish month or the last month of the of the year. So almost another year over. Uh, a lot of paint work uh, that I have done and more to come. Um, we are going to face Christmas, some family time and as well some time uh, for painting. I hope to have some during these holidays some time to paint at the end of the month, the beginning of the new year. So, but let's go. First, a little bit recap of what uh, have been the, the month of November. So in the month of November, I did the tutorial on the Blob Bolt Ball, in case you are interested. I did the tutorial on the Briar Queen. Uh, I did another tutorial as well, or oh, it's in progress. The tutorial on the uh, Forge Fin for Alpha Legion. So here we see it's still in progress and the second part will come soon, uh, finishing the world most likely. So quite happy how it's looking like. It's a fun miniature to paint, to be fair. Uh, I have it in my collection for a long time, pending to be painted, never deciding which legion to paint and at the end I decide to go for the Alpha Legion. So this is what has been the month, uh, the month of uh, November. So for the month of uh, December, first of all, as an, I like to do, here you have three options that you can vote uh, what you want to be uh, one of the next tutorials. This can be the Sniper, this is the one from um, Blackstone Fortress, the, the Warhammer Quest um, game inspired in, for in, the, or in the universe of 40k. Here we have the Cryptek again, it's back in the pool. Uh, this is the one for uh, Forge, uh, is the one from Forge Bane. Uh, and here, if you are interested, I'm going for a very particular color scheme. I go for a green monochrome. So I will try to use only uh, greens colors, black and greens. This is going to be the objective to paint uh, my neck ones. I want to go for a unique color scheme based on green. And here we have the other one is the the guy from Shadespire, the little goblin. Uh, very familiar to great base with all these mushrooms, so also quite interesting to paint. <clears throat> and you know that if it's not coming in December, it will come in Jan because it's a really what to paint all, paint all the war bands. So these are the three options. So let me know what uh, would you like to see next. And depending on what uh, you decide, it will uh, also lead on what I will paint um, um, or what is going to be what I will paint uh, on top. So, because I have three projects that I want to work with, one is to paint all the um, Shadespire, or not Shadespire, the Warhammer Underworlds of Warband, so they, I have two paintings to be painted, these are the Goblins and the Thench one, so uh, if you vote for that, most likely will come with the other Warband uh, in the month of December. Uh, if you vote for uh, this guy, I will start painting the Black Fortress miniature, so uh, most likely the month of December will be uh, and, and Jan will be dedicated to um, Warhammer Quest Black Fortress. And if you vote for that, I will paint all the naked ones they have, most likely. So it's not only these three miniatures, it also will drive what is going to be the next projects. It doesn't matter that maybe I combine something in between, because I have to do some, some other things. I want to finish the Blob Bull team that I, uh, the or Blob Bull team that I'm painting. So here, just as a, you have seen the troll before. But it's not only that I'm painting the wall, I also paint some alternative miniatures. Okay, let me move the camera a little bit down. Oh, this wall is not very stable, to be fair. Okay, so this, I paint some other orcs, and here you have some um, uh, some of the orcs painted, okay? So I will paint the full team, and I will also showcase the full team. So it's quite fun, and it's a tabletop uh, paint job, not too much detail. Uh, quite and um, to uh, we also I also paint some of the goblins they want to put in the orc team. So I'm trying to paint them. Uh, it's, it's been painted in parallel with other projects that I've been painting. So uh, these are things that you will see in the channel. And yeah, and this is the more most likely the projects that I'm working with. So uh, looking forward to see your vote and and see what is the what where we have the most interest on in the painting jobs. What else will come in the channel in the month of? Uh, December, of course, just beginning of the month, I will do the uh, what's called this share your miniatures. Okay, the video where I go through the Facebook um, site, the Facebook group I have. So, if you're interested to share your miniatures, you can go to my Facebook group, link in the comments below. And <coughs> sorry, 
And then I, what I do is I go through all the viewers, miniatures, all the people, all the miniatures that the people have um, uh, just shared. I do this. I will try to do it live this Saturday, so this means tomorrow when this video is published is going to be tomorrow. And normally I try to to go live and talk, and if, and if you can chat with me, I will answer questions as well live. So. I try to do one live a month, and this is I, I use uh, the share your miniatures um, topic to do this live. So I'm really uh, looking forward if you want to connect with me and to chat a little bit. Um, so I'm looking forward for that. Um, what else? Uh, um, I will do maybe yeah. If I buy something, I, I'm waiting at, at Christmas. Maybe I will buy a couple of things. Uh, I have seen the new. Uh, books for Blood Bowl and Necromunda, maybe I, I will unbox them. Uh, as I said, the unboxings in my channel does not come before the launch because uh, I don't receive material before launch, so I have to wait until I have money and time to buy the material and have it at home. So this is why I don't, I cannot do it at launch or maybe I have to wait a, a couple of days or weeks to do the unboxings. And as well, I'm planning to participate in an Age of Sigmar tournament. I will go again with my Stormcast Eternals. I have a list that I think can be quite interesting. It's quite a hero power list. So I will go with six heroes and one of the heroes is going to be the, the Celestian Lord on... on uh, sorry, the Lord Celestian on the no, on Dracoth, on the start of the week. Okay, so I'm going to have a quite a um, um, hero power army. I want to experiment a little bit and see how it works. Of course, I will have the Evocators. I think the Evocators are the best unit of the Stormcast Eternals today. And yeah, this is more or less the plans. Of course, uh, we will have holidays. I will. Uh, we are going to have some holiday videos. I will try to keep my daily video if it's possible. And I will try to do as much tutorials as I can if I have time. Normally, when my parents are coming over, I don't have that much time to do tutorials because I have to paint and they're watching the TV in my same room, so because I'm in the living room. So uh, while they're watching TV, I cannot do uh, videos or tutorials. So this is why sometimes when they are here, I do less tutorials. But I try to do the, the maximum I can. I, try, I will try to share as much as I can. For sure, one of these three miniatures will come in the month of December. So yeah, and that's all. That's all what I want to talk here. Uh, I hope you're having a great time. Uh, also, uh, I always forget to mention, but if you want to support me, you can support me in Patreon. And if you think that uh, my work deserves some support and the tutorial deserves some support, you can support me in Patreon. Just for one dollar, it's it's good enough, and it helps me to have more material and to buy more material to do these tutorials and try to add diversity. So the yeah, the most I can link the channel to what I can buy. Uh, the better because then I can I can uh, tailor the tutorials to what the people needs, um, and then yeah I'm thinking to do something special for Patreons maybe to put some uh, um, exclusive pictures uh, for the Patreons and some exclusive content for the Patreons uh, in the new year in the next year. So I'm thinking about that just to um, is it, the main uh, objective is to thank you the people that is supporting me uh, in Patreon as well. So that's all what I want to talk here. Um, please leave in the comments below, especially answer the question A, it's the Elder, uh, to the Cryptech, 3, the Goblin. So uh, looking forward to see what are your answers, looking forward to see what are um, uh, your options. And as usual, if you want to comment anything or you have any question for me, you can leave it in this video in the comments below or you can now go to the Ask Victor video and leave the questions and then I will ask them in the middle of the month as well. And that's all. This is enough policy for my channel. I think this is enough. I, I hope you are interested in what is coming in the month of December. I will try to push tutorials and I will go to a, a Age of Sigma tournament so I will, as I, I'm expecting to be able to put uh, more battle reports of Age of Sigma in this channel. That's all for now. As usual, thanks a lot for watching and see you again later. Bye!